dissolve. To illustrate dissolve and how it works, I'm just going to employ a cube here. Okay, I'm going to go into edit mode, grab its face in the end and hit control E, control E. Then I'm just going to add a modifier to it, hitting tab, then going into modifier. Subdivide it up a few times and hit apply. All right, now this has a lot of geometry. And what I want to do is reduce that amount of geometry. To do this, we could grab edge loops. So I'm going to grab the edge tool, hold control and no, shift and alt. Shift and alt allows you to highlight the entire edge loop going all the way around. And I could go in here and delete that edge loop by going into delete and then delete edge loop. Now that works great for one edge loop, but if you go to highlight several edge loops, what happens is this. It only deletes the ones that were highlighted last. Okay, so here's dissolve and how it works. First off, I'll do the same thing. I'll highlight the edge loops and then go in here and say dissolve. The problem with this is there's some vertices left behind. So we can go to vertices and then also hit dissolve. Now that cleans up the area and deletes many edge loops at the same time. So what I would suggest to you is probably go in here, right click on it and say add shortcut. And whether you, whatever key you want in this, uh, I'll hit maybe D on the keyboard. And you can manage that shortcut by going into user preferences. Let's go to input. Let's go to, I think it's going to be under mesh. Which is underneath another one. Let's see if I remember right. 3D view. Mesh. Ah, there we go. So if we page all the way down, we have dissolve now. So if you ever want a different key, you can always go in here and say Control D or Shift Alt D or whatever you want. I'm just going to have D on mine. I use it all the time, so whatever hot key that was there before uh, is not as important as this to me. All right, let's try it out. D, go into vertices, D. There we go, just a little cleanup and voila, works perfect. And that is the dissolve feature in Blender. Enjoy.